Today we're going to talk about heat pumps. Heat pump works both in cooling and heating. Today we're going to talk about the cooling cycle. I'm going to point out the different components. This is a reversing valve. This is a suction accumulator. This is a compressor. This is a muffler, not to be confused with the filter dryer. The filter dryer is right here. And those are the components that make up a heat pump. Now let's talk about the cooling cycle. As the refrigerant goes through your indoor evaporator, it comes back out as a low pressure vapor. It goes in through the suction line, as we in the field like to refer to as. It comes through the unit, down through the reversing valve, just makes a loop through the reversing valves, comes out, goes into the accumulator, still has a low pressure vapor, comes out as a low pressure vapor, goes into the compressor, through the heat of compression, it turns into a high pressure. So as the high pressure gas goes through the muffler, it'll come out the bottom of the muffler, comes into the bottom of the reversing valves, loops through as a high pressure gas comes out and comes right up this tube right here comes into the top of the coil makes its circuit comes back out these capillary tubes here goes through the check valve goes down comes out this line right here and goes back to the indoor evaporator coil if you have any questions how a heat pump works Give us a call at Jones Air Conditioning and Electrical, 239-596-5855, or go to jonesairconditioning.com. Thank you.